Hey, it's me. Today, I'm gonna be opening a bunch of mail that you guys have sent to my P.O. box full of helpless, lost, pathetic squishies. And we're just gonna look at them today. A select few will get help soon. They will go into squishy makeovers and be saved. The rest will just have to wait. The hospital is a little backed up. Anyway, do you notice anything different? Not about me, about the space. This is the first time I'm filming an unboxing video in my new little room. There's still quite a bit of empty space over there, so we're gonna just wallpaper the entire wall with artwork eventually, hopefully. Also, I painted this drawer. I didn't like how dark it was before, so yeah. Do you like it? Hopefully you do, because it's kind of too late now. Anyway, let's start opening. Let's start with this guy. This is from Jazlyn. Opening it, we've got wrapping paper. Aha, what do we have here? Oh my gosh. What is this? I believe it's a fox. No. Yeah. Yes, it's a fox. The Christmas fox with a wreath around its neck. It has such a huge air pocket in its ear. It's like completely deflated. His facial expression really confuses me. It's like evil and happy and <laughs> Love this. Thank you. And there's one more in here. Oh, oh. So this is one of those velvet squishies. So it's a squishy, but it's covered in velvet. Velvet. I saw these in the store and I was like, I don't really know about that. Velvet low key gives me the creeps. Oh gosh. It's not as bad as like cotton balls. Cotton balls make me cringe. Oh, just the thought. Velvet is like the cotton balls less annoying friend. I just... It's, it's, it's not you, it's me, okay? Also, I'm not really sure how easy it would be to paint this. I don't know what it would look like. These were very interesting. I enjoyed the experience of opening them, so thank you, Jazlyn. I'm gonna start a pile here. Yeah. Next, this one is from Pen and Joe. Hey guys. Look at this decoration job. That is rocking it. Oh, this is such a sweet little note. This is what they've sent. So we have a little, well, not really little. I just call everything little by default. We have a soft and slow cat, classic broken neck. Oh, here's a new one. Um. <laughs> With a tail. It's cute. I really love that it's laying in a little cradling position. <laughs> With a tail. I think I might reposition the tail, po possibly. They sent me a little blue narwhal squeezable. Oh my gosh, I love this. The color is so cute. You just the cutest little oh, baby. Oh, you did a baby little dude. Oh, uh, a panda ice cream. He looks quite scared. I do really love this shape. Look at those little toppings on his head, but he doesn't look the happiest. <laughs> a Las Vegas pen. I love the bling. Never been there, but this is just as good as going. <laughs> awesome. Thank you guys so much for the package. Let's open this one next. Look at how pretty it is with the sunflowers all over it. That's just gorgeous, right? I smell something fruity. It's, it's, it's jelly belly bubbles. Does that mean that they're edible? Cause if they're edible, that's kind of awesome. But if they're not, I don't want to die. <laughs> oh, let's do that outside. And then we have a box. Okay. Yeah. Look at this artwork. Oh my gosh. This is so cool. I love this. This is definitely going on my wall. Make room. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Thank you for that. This is so sweet. Okay, so this is from a mom and her two daughters. Oh. We are in stress ball territory here, but still, that is pretty epic, I would say. This is a familiar face. I used a squishy that looked very similar for Rudolph. Rudolph. He's over there. He's in the problematic eye squad. It was definitely slightly different, but the same design, but different. And this one is missing an antler. What is this? A smushy mushy? It feels very heavy. Oh, it's not a squishy. It reminds me of... 
I mean, I'm no slime expert, you know that, but it's actually kind of nice. What do you guys think? And we have, oh, uh-huh. A little unicorn hugging on the moon. There's a little separation there. Thank you so much, Trista, and your two daughters as well, Delaney and Vivian. Check out this little package. She had her address and my address. Connected by a rainbow. The design decisions are on point. Look at that little surprise detailing. You thought of everything. Okay, so this is from Annalise. She says, your channel is the pillar of life that is keeping me happy. No pressure there. And this one is from Ellen. I tend to ramble, so this letter may be longer than some of your others. Ooh, let me just... She calls these the Mariah Elizabeth trading cards. Images of my squishies and oh my gosh, and they're laminated? Wow, squishy ghost. Have we seen him in this room yet? We got sunglasses. Good, what is... This is a homemade toy for Opie. You know what? I'll bet he will love this. Is that from Harry Potter? Is this like the golden stitch? Snitch? Sitch? A flower? Is it too much? No, of course not. Oh, okay, so these are the squishies. We've got a very, very damaged cake roll, cracking, chunks missing. We got the whole situation here. We have a pudding that's almost completely naked. All the color likes to peel off of them until they're just butt naked. Half a panda bun. Um, yep, just, just half. Whoa now. Whoa, this is the rainbow loom creation of the century. There's a duck, there's a cat, there's a paintbrush. My initials in rainbow? Amazing! There's so much cute little thoughtfulness in this box and I really appreciate it. There's so much thoughtfulness, it's not fitting back inside. Okay, how about this one? It's a very tall box, but it feels very light. Ah, yes. Okay, this is from Evie and Max. Very, very pretty aesthetic right off the bat, I must say. A ring pop. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. A tooth. It's like kind of a gooey squish. Gooey. What exactly is this? Ribbon kind of thingy. Paint your own mini squishies. It's a kit and it's brand new in the shrink wrap. I really want to rip it open, but I'll save it for another video. Maybe it'll be good. And then this fish, which looks like it was a DIY squishy and the paint peeled off. That's my guess. For some reason, DIY squishies are never actually paintable. Cute, love this package. This is awesome. We have a decorative box inside of a boring box. It has my name on it. Many cat faces also. Look at this. Never seen this little guy. That little bow tie. The beak is a little flat. What happened to your beak, son? Still really cute. Mm. Look at this lollipop. That is pretty cool. And inside is this little dog. Ooh, a plain donut squishy that's incredibly soft. Ooh. That's very soft. This is from Kate and Chris, brother and sister. Thank you guys. Please do more create this book. I will. I will. I found this one which is super heavy, so I'm intrigued. From Daphne. No wonder, it is jam-packed. Oh, Hello Kitty in a giraffe suit. Look at it, look at it, cute! I, I, a bath bomb. A bath bomb. Peppermint swirl, an alpaca. Why is its face so orange? Looks like it's got a fake tan. The paint job is in dire need. Oh, hi! Cute cat, oh, I love the cat. Oh, 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 oh. Them again, with a big chunk missing. I wonder if I could make a whole cake with all the slices of cake. No, that's a bad idea. A big loaf of squished bread. Oh man, the bread got squished. What happens when you put it in the bottom of the grocery bag and then, you know, forget about it. 
terrible joke. A strawberry squishy. Somebody tried to decorate it with a temporary tattoo and it peeled off. I think I've seen people do that. I always wondered how it would last and if it would be durable at all. I think this answers my question. Oh my gosh, a whole bag of mini squishies. They have a little label on here that says tiny squishies. What is that? It's an ice cream scoop. This will definitely get added to some sort of dessert. Oh, I love this. Oh, yes. Oh, and a little box. It says, all you need is love and a cat. Yeah. French fries. The color is very brown. We're verging on burnt here. Thank you so much, Daphne. You were incredibly generous with all these squishies that you put in here. Next box. Oh, lovely. Free air. Um... Crumbs. She said that this was a koala. Koala, obviously. There we go, okay. It's finished. This isn't bad, I could work with this. I'm sure it was beautiful when it was new, but it's needs help. Then what else do we have? A cat holding something yellow. A yellow bag, maybe? I don't, I, I don't know, I don't know. And the last one is a rainbow. A rainbow. At least the colors are in correct order. That's something. Why can't I sneeze? Oh, thank you, Dell. These are some good projects. This is from Caitlin. Aw, Caitlin. She sent the sweetest freaking letter. It's... Oh my gosh it's a bear ice cream cone this is too cute i definitely don't have this one a smushy mushy cup looks like a little ketchup container holy crap wow this is like the complete set it's a dog with a hamburger on its head and then it comes with little french fries what oh that is just too good. Mm, too good. And this squishy, quite dirty and cracked, very well loved. But it has a cute little face drawn on it, so I'm not sure how to feel. Kind of cute, kind of gross at the same time. <gasps> she made this coaster. I'm assuming this is like resin and there's sprinkles in there. I am in love love with it. Thank you so much. This is one of my prized possessions. Oh my gosh. She customized a notebook for me. Wow, you're like really talented with crafty stuff. Ooh. A necklace. There's like a cage of little treasure gems. That is so pretty. I like it. This looks like a guinea pig or a hamster made out of rainbow loom. Does this take forever? Because it looks super complicated. Rainbow loom cotton candy. I'm pretty sure. If it's not, can it be? because I really like that. Wow, that is super cool. Smooth and glossy, I'm a fan. Caitlin, Caitlin, you gave me so much stuff, put so much time into this. This was an amazing package. This one is from Ava. <coughs> Finally. I just sneezed on my squishies. So we have a little heart brownie. Classic. Oh, a little... Let me not call everything little. A narwhal. Awesome. It's a big fat sloth. Mm, I don't know about the colors. Colors are kind of weird. Why are its claws purple and then its feet are blue and then its eyes are bright pink and then its body's pink? What does it have on its head also? It's got a little lump. Why do I feel like it could be like a human baby? I just feel like this is a baby body. That's weird. No, don't do that. But yeah, thank you, Ava. We have this one. Wow. Um, wow! It looks like we tried to paint it with acrylic paint, it started cracking, and then we put a very thick coat of puppy paint on there, and that started peeling. It's been through some stuff. I think if I could finish peeling this, uh, we could clean this up enough to salvage it. It's not dead, but it is brutally ill. This is a cookie from that same kit that I did. Yours turned out better than mine. And a little present. Wait. Oh, is this just tape? Is there something in the tape? Um, is the gift the tape? I've been unwrapping for a minute. Okay. It's rock hard clay. It's an interesting situation. I'm not exactly sure what the intention was because there's no explanation, but, um, 
That's that. A whole bunch of glitter. Wow. I got some projects. I got some cute things. Okay, we have an envelope. She's strange. It's a fluffy koala wearing a bow, holding a leaf in a polka dot skirt. It's also interesting how it's completely pink. Weird. An elephant. I believe its head has been glued back on. Oh, look, it's another reindeer. This one has got a huge head. Look at the size of that head. Candy bar person. Still kind of gives me the creeps, to be honest, but I think we could fix the creepy factor, possibly. Oh, okay, so this is from Molly from Ireland. Thank you so much for sending this. Looks like a cat toy. I'm pretty sure this is for Opie. Thank you. I will introduce this to him later along with his other one and we'll just have a ball. This is cute. It's a Minnie Mouse cake. Somebody attempted to paint this and then it looks like they lost interest. The ears are coming off a little bit, but this is super cute. We have a unicorn, a fish, a fish trapped in a ball. Its face is... <laughs> Pretty scary, actually. I'm glad you're trapped in there because you freak me out. Oh, look, it could be a cookie. Whether it is a cookie or not, I'm not sure, but it could be a cookie. And look at that, some fabric paint also. Thanks for that. I think this is gonna be the last one for today. Oh wow, okay, from Avery, Tegan, Madeline, and Gianna. So they pull together and combine all their unwanted squishies. Let's see. We have a cute little polar bear. Why does it have white paint on it though? Paint the polar bear white? <laughs> it's not already white, friend. Oh, that's why. I couldn't resist, I pulled it off because there's a marker stain on it. So they're trying to cover up the marker. Okay. A very festive looking apple. This one who looks like its head was put back on with paint. Eh, not a bad job actually. I really love the colors on this squishy though. Oh. <laughs> I don't know why this one makes me laugh, but it does. It's obviously a sheep head, but it just looks so derpy. It is intensely soft. A unicorn cake, very festive, again. Oh my gosh, look at this adorable little thing. It's got a whole kind of outfit going on. Wow, thank you all so much for all of these. Oh man, my necklace is turned around. I hope it wasn't like that for like half the video. Why didn't you tell me? Okay, so that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I went through quite a few packages today and a bunch of them were just so amazing, so thoughtful. Thank you to everyone who has sent me mail. I will see you guys next Friday. Bye!